Dan and Yuveka, thank you very much again. You join us from our special broadcast point overlooking uh, the overlooking the stadium, where we will have this uh, bird's eye view of all the action uh, throughout uh, the course of the day. Um, I think the two things have come across throughout the course of the morning. One, uh, people are saying the rain is not going to deter them. That's the one thing. The other thing, which I think we found absolutely extraordinary, is every single person that we have spoken to and will speak to has a smile on their face today Indeed. and that is beautiful and it's mm. remarkable people have been coming here in their droves we have been mm. here since about six o'clock this morning and people started queuing up early they heeded the call mm. made to them by government that they must arrive here early for logistical purposes we expect FNB stadium which has a capacity of 90 to 95 thousand mm. to be packed to the rafters including those nearly a hundred mm. heads of state who are coming here to pay their respects to Nelson Mandela of course it's a big day for the African National Congress the party that Mandela served so many years and served as president and we're now joined by the Gauteng Premier Nomfula Mokanyana thank you so much for chatting to us welcome Anna. thank you Nomfula. we spoke to you a few days ago and you were looking a bit glum how are you feeling today well um, mixed uh, reaction uh, it's beginning to become a reality that uh, Tata is now sleeping. Um, but uh, in his sleep, uh, there's also this excitement that we're doing it for him. This is typical of uh, the world icon. Um, here is South Africa is now an assembly of nations happening at Soccer City, just a stone's throw away from Orlando, Villagas Street. We quite are also humbled by the response of South Africans, residents of uh, Gauteng, who have cooperated with law enforcement agencies, who have also heeded the call that we must all arrive here on time, and uh, who we are also quite uh, confident that uh, they will give the proceedings uh, the necessary respect so that we take the message out of every speaker here today, and of importance that when we live here, we'll be better and different people compared to what we were yesterday. Madam Premier, you're one of those speakers. In fact, you're going to close proceedings, if I'm not mistaken, right, at the, uh, right at the end of the day. You're going to be talking to, a, to an audience of 95,000 on an auspicious, uh, important day. Um, does that daunt you? Or you, are you excited because you feel that you're doing something it, really it's, important? It's a daunting yeah, task. Sure it, is. Uh, yeah. it is a daunting mm. task, but um, again, it's, it's, a, it's a mission that has been assigned, and I'm quite humbled that I'll be representing South Africa, uh, thanking the world uh, for, for, for the support, thanking heads of state, but thanking an ordinary Gogo who has woken up early in the morning, and the lady who I had uh, through your program, saying she was here from 2.30 yeah. to say I think the ordinary her. gogo is in fact more important. Absolutely. The person that has taken it. The, the, the this is a person mm. Who, mm. Who, who has dared the weather. Mm. This is the person who has deprived herself mm. decent sleep. And just like Mad Madiba, mm. when he walked out of Victor Festa, who said, I'm handing my entire life to you. Mm. People are now saying, we want to give our all mm. to you, Madiba. We've seen over the past few days this incredible spirit in South Africa, this celebratory mood, mostly through song and dancing and chanting. What was that of song? <laughs> Madiba, Madiba does not necessarily sing, mm -hmm. but Madiba would always enjoy dancing mm -hmm. and responding. But one song, one song that I know that uh, Madiba enjoyed and he will actually a, a smile. He actually asked, what does that song mean? Was this one of Oliver Tambo, Teta Lopo, <laughs> yes. da, uh, mm. And we were, we were here at Orlando yeah. Stadium, mm. very young, mm. highly energetic, mm. coming from the National General Don't Council. let's talk about <laughs> age, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and he, he asked, mm. to say, what does this song mm. mean? And he then stood up and he, he, he just got excited. Mm -hmm. And that's where the Madiba dance mm -hmm. actually started oh, with yeah. that song. Okay. Oliver Tambo Teta no Pota Sing it for us, Premier. Come oh, my voice. <laughs> Oliver Tambo, Oliver Tambo Teta no Pota and he just beamed at Orlando. Remember, mm -hmm. the fences went down. Today we've got Soccer City, mm -hmm. state of the art. Wonderful. We've come a long way. And we've heard that song along with many others being sung here at FNB the entire morning. Nikki and I have had an opportunity uh, in, this, in, the, in the past couple of days to engage with many international visitors that have mm -hmm. come. 
some of them have said to us that they are surprised that there is not a more somber state, that we have come out and we're starting to celebrate. Uh, and it's difficult to explain to them that that is what South Africans are good at doing, and it's, it comes from the heart. It's what we want to that, do. That's exactly mm. us. Mm. Through song and dance, mm. we mourn. Through song and dance, we celebrate. Mm. And what is important with us is that we also are very, a, a very strong believing nation uh, with our diversity. Mm. And that diversity comes together and gel through song and dance. Because uh, all different uh, religions, all different cultures can actually come together around, around this. Yes. yes, there are moments where we shed a tear. Mm. I've cried. Mm. I've even fell. I've fallen and uh, mm. I cried. And some and Deputy Secretary General of the NCJ said, you needed this because now you are crying. Mm. And some kind of Yeah, presence. yes. Yeah. And, and waking up in the morning, having to sort out the... The, the catering for, for dignitaries, and you shed a tear, and that tear is not a, a tear of saying you, you've woken me up. It's a tear that says I'm part of making history mm -hmm. and moving beyond Matiba's legacy and making his dream a reality. While we as South Africans and indeed the world mourn and also celebrate the life of Nelson Mandela, we can't, of course, we must never forget the family. How are they doing today? The family, the family is, 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 is doing well, well in an, in an environment of mourning um, and, and also being overwhelmed by the support that they, they, have, re they have received, but also themselves having gone through these months and weeks of Tata not, uh, not, not being well. But you see, um, Madiba's family is a, is a family of uh, survivors. Um, and, and this process also has shown that thread that runs across the Madiba family. And I really think Madiba has made an indel mm. indelible uh, mark that mm. whatever their differences, what unites them I mean, is You're Madiba. right. I mean, bearing up with great fortitude because uh, Dr. William Kesey was with us uh, in that chair mm -hmm. just a few moments ago, and I think he used the word intrude. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you know, that we as, as a nation yeah. invaded. Yeah. Uh, True. That is happening, and True. I think that they're bearing up uh, with and, a great and, deal. And, and remember, mm -hmm. we want to claim Madiba more mm -hmm. than them, mm -hmm. and yet here is a man who never had time mm -hmm. with them. Yeah. And, and being an activist, I see my family through Madiba's family mm -hmm. to say, this is what we do to our families. Uh, we give ourselves our all to, to the nation and our families uh, become part of a bigger community. Premier, let's give you an opportunity to talk about your province because uh, not <laughs> yes, only is please. South Africa in uh, being showcased, but uh, also the province of, of, of Gauteng. And I think the one thing that has struck us, certainly coming in today, uh, was uh, the, the, the number of, of, of metro policemen, of policemen generally, of auxiliary volunteers, uh, the people with the orange coats, the, 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 the ushers. Uh, people have been called back from leave. Uh, people really putting their back into something like this. And I think this is testimony to the hard work of, uh, of the province. You know, you know? What we here, here is your opportunity. Um, yeah. the, the minute we, we got yeah. uh, the yeah. message, we, we called every bit of our capacity. We, we added up to the national yeah. plan and the international plan. What you have from Gauteng are people who are patrollers in their streets, mm. members of street committees, members of their neighborhood watches, mm. who are part of the security plan for wow. this particular mm -hmm. occasion. Secondly, you have uh, private security companies, you've got the army, you've got the South African police service. But of importance, every South African, okay. throughout the period of mourning, so all of us have been around, so all of us have been involved. Premier, we Premier, just Premier, we're just going to interrupt you very briefly. Pictures we're seeing the arrival of the British Prime Minister, uh, David Cameron, of course. He's also accompanied by two predecessors of mm -hmm. his as well, such as the large international contingent and mm -hmm. interest in this particular memorial. And I'm sensing that uh, as, as we're starting to get closer to 11 o'clock, now we're going to see that, uh, that, that, that line of international leaders and dignitaries uh, starting to arrive, uh, arrive very quickly. Let's break away. Premier, thank you very much indeed. You most and uh, good luck with and your closing remarks. And thanks to the residents of Gauteng. Let's mm. continue to cooperate. Indeed. Thank indeed. you very much indeed.